Eds, welcome back to the channel. On today's live stream, it's been a while, we're gonna be unboxing the Angway X24. This is like a folding moped style, maybe electric mountain bike style e-bike uh, with dual batteries. Uh, before we get started on this unboxing, if you guys do wanna support the channel, check out that link down below for the Angway uh, X24. I think they're having a, a sale right now for $100 off. Everybody, Dee Dee's not behind the camera right now. She's about to pop back around, say hi to Dee Dee. Hey guys. Dee Dee. Say hi to everybody. Um, yeah, so the link's down below for 100 bucks off. If Angway isn't for you, check out all those other links down below. There might be a bike you like. Uh, so Dee Dee, would you like to say hi to everybody and see who's in here? I hey thought guys. there was like five people in here already. I'd all like right. to catch up and figure out what we've done since our live stream last time. Like. Did we go live since we've been to New York, the expo? Have oh, we, maybe not. Have we not, been, have we not talked about our time at the expo? Yes, yeah, so we can talk about that too. Yep. Okay, so let's see who's in the chat. We have Fluff24, happy birthday, Emilio. What's up, Fluff24, and happy birthday, Emilio. It's your birthday today. How old are you? We have Shredheads member, Nevermind. What's up, Nevermind, guys? If uh, you guys want to become a Shredhead member, Make sure to check out that link down below. It's like youtube.com forward slash shreddy mcscape forward slash join. Click on that, five bucks a month. Help, this, help support the channel. We're trying to get this cargo van here on this channel so we can get out of here this winter and go travel and meet some of you guys and do some group rides. Um, you also get um, videos about a day or two early. Right now actually is a video available for Shredhead members, which is gonna be, which one is it? The top three e best E-Motos that I saw at Electrify Expo. I got to ride them, talk about them. So uh, if you wanna become a Shredhead member, watch that video now, it's only five bucks. We also have Anaconda Hugs in the chat. What's up Anaconda Hugs? How you doing over there, brother? Hope you're doing well. iScoot Connecticut. What's up iScoot Connecticut? How you doing? What the hell is that? What? Oh my God. <laughs> Oh, look at this. So I skewed actually stopped by the uh, powerful lithium booth and dropped this off. There's also a ball of yarn over there. I don't, I don't know if we're going to learn how to do that or not, but Dee Dee may try to learn, yeah. but hopefully uh, the pink one's for Dee Dee and the black one's for me. So I'll, I'll slap it on my no, head. No, the pink one's for you. The black one's for you. No, I'm kidding. Oh, you want me to trail them? Thank you, I Scoot. <laughs> yeah. I Scoot said Robert and Wendy from Hartford, Connecticut here. Now I'll put on the the black one. It looks good on you. I like the pink. You like the pink one? Oh, that looks good too. Yeah. Oh, it's nice and warm. That's awesome. Dolly. Thank you, brother. Oh yeah, perfect timing because it's getting chilly now. Uh huh. It's like it's like 70 degrees at night now, and that's cold to us. Dolly said, "What's up?" Thank you, brother. I appreciate it. What's up, Dolly? Did you say Dolly? Yes. What's up, Dolly? How you doing? The Joe Hamilton. What up, Shreddy? What's up, Joe Hamilton? How you doing, brother? Where's Joe everybody from right now? Where are we all from? Joe the Toe. Hey, yo. Yo, what up, Joe the and Toe? Dolly. How you said doing, my bro? From San Diego. Whoa, that's awesome. I want to go visit San Diego very soon. Which reminds me, I have a friend named Mike from San Diego that helped me get a good deal on. A laptop. I finally am editing videos on a laptop and not on my iPhone 14 anymore. So we got a MacBook. I guess I'll show that to you. I'm actually really happy about this because it, it's made my editing a lot faster and a lot more fun too. Like being able to see the big, big screen and all this stuff on it. So yeah, we got a, um, the, the newest MacBook Pro, the 14 inch. It's like a, the Apple... Uh, what is Mac that? Mac Air? Yeah, it's like a, the Max 2 chip on there, 38 core, 64 gigs of, uh, of RAM. So this thing is, is really fast and I'm so happy. It's <laughs> rendering my videos super fast. I'm able to get the videos off the GoPro on there really fast. So that's going to be saving me a lot of time. And who's, who, who else? What else? <laughs> we also have uh, Yair Sosa. What's up, Shreddy? What's up, Yair? How you doing? How you doing? All right, we're going to get started on this, this unboxing. So if you guys do stick around to the end of the video, I do have a surprise. Um, two boxes to unbox. I might do one of them. I do both um, to show you guys for another bike. It's an upgrade, and you, I think you guys would be pretty stoked about what it is. <laughs> I see Ice Cute's comment. Maybe they won't know Ice Cute. Uh, Joe the Toe, Brooklyn NYC here. What up? How you doing, brother? Joe OSW, greetings from Mackinac Island, Michigan. Oh, oh what's going on? How you doing, Joe? Um, was there two Joes in a row? <laughs> 
Mike Morgan like actually caught one away. of these live unveilings. Heck yeah, I'm stoked you're here, brother. Um, all right, there goes my arch enemies, these freaking staples, man. Uh, bubble Magic said, cool shirt, Shreddy. Thank you, brother. Thank you. It actually came with a pack of bubble gum, mate, like the first day. <laughs> I love candy so much, I can't, like, save it. I bought, like, two pounds of taffy and ate them in, like, a week. <laughs> Tangy taffy, tartan Where's tangy your taffy. Shirt from? Which is my favorite. Actually, I got this from Red Band, shopsquad.com. Check it out. Check. Is there anything on the back? No. I haven't checked. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, I like the colors. It's really cool. Pretty awesome. <laughs> Death Squad. Um, all right. I think I'm going to lay this down. I'm probably going to get poked by these damn staples, but it is what it is. I'm going to scoot this back. Okay, we got all black. Oh, wow. It's got like almost the same shocks as the Aerial Rider Grizzly. Remember Has last... anyone in the chat seen this bike yet? Ooh. Last video was like a little struggle with Shreddy and that dang go-kart. But we finally got that thing running. So I got to shoot part of the review today. Just got to get more B-roll on that thing. That thing's a blast. All right. We're gonna pull this straight out. This this bike is pretty big. Does that box pop up like the other ones? You guys know I've been I've been struggling to open some of these boxes. <laughs> They're a lot easier than I thought they were. Not this one. Not this one. Joe OSW, I stayed in Greenpoint, Brooklyn during the Occupy Wall Street movement back in the day. Great people, good times. Can you please reread that? <laughs> I stayed in Greenpoint, Brooklyn during the Occupy Wall Street movement back in the day. Great, good people, great people, good times. Very cool, very cool. Whoa, what's this? Oh, I it's an extra seat. Oh. An That's extra? for you, Dee Dee. Are you ever going to jump on the back of a bike with me, ever? Maybe you when I get an electric motorcycle. There's two seats? <laughs> so they have like a regular... Wait, can like, you show us that again? I don't know if I have the camera low enough. It's like a regular like... Nice. It's like a moped style like... Seat, but this is a regular bicycle seat that we have here. Let me get this stuff. Blades. Any questions, guys? Um, let's see. Did you guys catch the New York group ride video where I rode the surround through the streets like a maniac? And then at the end of it, I forgot to turn on the headlights, which I normally always turn on my headlights if I was on my bike. But you know how you hop on other people's bikes. You're not used to it. That but man, was that was fun. The group ride the night before Electrify Expo in New York? Yeah, he, um, I went really fast. Dee told me not to go fast or ride on the highway that night. And I like apologized on the video before she even saw the video. <laughs> so, yep, yeah, that was it. If you guys saw that video, drop a thumbs up in the chat. Drop a like. Drop what a like if you guys. Called? Like fastest e bikes in New York? Or something. Rip through like, New York or yeah. something. That looks like a comfy seat, actually. We'll see, we'll see. Oh, this has 24 inch tires. What's this from like an X series? It has like a 24, 26, and what was the other one? Yes, the Angway Super X series. This is the Angway X24. I'm just showing you guys, this is how you can do it. If you're by yourself and you don't have a friend to help you pull the bike straight up, just yank it out, lay it down. So it's the Angway X24 electric bike. It's a folding fat tire e-bike. Dude, this thing looks serious. We got a freaking old school phone cord going on over here. Hello? <laughs> <laughs> Hello, who is this? Who is this? iScoot said, Angway is sending me an X26. It is just like the X24, but bigger tires. The 26 inch tires. I wonder if they make this in a 20 inch tire. Yes, they do. Okay. They have the Angway X20, X24, and X26. Didi could ride a 20 inch tire one, I bet. Good for tall and shorter riders. So that's good, they have all different sizes. I might get this out the way. I'm sorry, guys. And you guys, um, Shreddy does have a discount uh, link in the video's description. Ow, Save $100 staples. off. You staples. I'll let one, bo one box in there, one box. Ah, boom. Get these staples out of here. Get them out of here. Dude, these staples. I wish they would just use like some sort of like tape or something. The Joe Hamilton. There we go. S P F L D I L here. 
What does that stand for? What is that? <laughs> S-P-L-F-I. S-P-F-L-D-I-L here. I do not know. What does that mean? Anybody? Anybody in the <laughs> chat? All right, we got tools. I was hoping I didn't have to run out there and get tools. Good stuff. And a two amp charger probably. Probably this has dual batteries. So it would be cool if we could have got two chargers. Um, what do we got, what do we got? Three amp charger, let's go. Put that in there. Usually, you know, when you get the bikes out, get the batteries out, get those suckers charging ASAP. Instruction manual, you know what happened last time when I did that, I'm probably gonna do it again. But that was with the go-kart and I never <laughs> unboxed or played with a go-kart ever like that in my life. All right, we've got uh, some tools. I'll put all that there. Get my screwdriver together. There we go. So show us Pedals. the tools it comes with. <laughs> Nice. Is that good? Is that good? Beautiful. All right, I gotta unsnap this. Guys, you have any questions while I'm unsnapping all these? We got more unboxings coming soon too, as I told you guys, we did the uh, Segway uh, review today. We gotta shoot a little bit more to finish it, but then we're gonna unbox the uh, Transformer Segway GT2 scooter. And that thing goes like 45 miles an hour. What else we got, D? Rad Power cargo bike. Oh yeah, we got a Rad Power Rad Runner 3 on the channel. We also have the center console with it. And and we got a freaking trailer, an e-bike trailer. So I'm, I'm hoping I'm able to use that trailer on multiple bikes, which would be so much fun. Especially on group rides, being able to carry stuff for people. Extra batteries, whatever. Anything needed. Grills, camping gear. Joe the stuff. Toast said, good bro, I missed the whole thing and the chance to meet you and others. Next time, hashtag Rogan up. Was that at uh, the Expo? At New York Electric Expo, were you there or were you gonna go? Or the DC Expo too, passed not too long ago. Yeah, that was a lot of fun. Shreddy was a guest judge at the um, Electrify Expo's Electrify Show Off. Um, he was a guest judge for the bike build off competition. Yeah, that was a lot of fun. Um, and what else, what else, Dee? Uh, I was gonna say something, but I totally, totally forgot. Oh yeah, I even got to ride in an electric drift car. Did I even get to tell you guys that? That's oh, gonna yeah. be not in the top three Emoto video, but it's gonna be in the full um, like Electrify Expo video. From New York, yeah. From New York, so that, that's gonna be a lot of fun, guys. That was crazy. I've never been in a drift car ever in my life, and that was my first time. All wheel drive, electric, it was like, 14 horsepower, oh my God, it was crazy, dude. I can't wait for you guys to see that. So I got the, I had the uh, GoPro in there, I was just holding it, just facing us, it was so cool. Prince Oja said hello from sunny Cali. Hey, is it still sunny out there right now? It's getting dark here now. What's up from dark <laughs> Delaware? <laughs> um, I skewed Connecticut, the extra, is for decoration only. There are no rear pegs, and the back is not rated for adults. What? I'm still I'm still throwing D on there. <laughs> Dude, you're getting on there. No, I'm definitely not getting on. No, I'm kidding. Shoebox right, said thumbs up. There's so much stuff to oh, cut so off this. Shoebox saw your group ride video. That's what the thumbs up are for. Oh, awesome, awesome. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys didn't miss it, go back over there and check it out. And then I don't know when the top three. Emoto uh, video is gonna come out for, for the rest. Maybe Saturday? Yeah, do you guys wanna see the top three Emoto video Saturday or Monday? Or Sunday. Or Sunday. Saturday, Sunday, or Monday. You can maybe do a poll back there. Oh, okay. Um, Joe the Toe, dude, some sick bikes in Brooklyn. Saw some at a place called Joker's Garage. Yeah, I met. Bikes and e -scooter customers. Yeah, yeah, I met, I think I met the owner of that place. Yeah, and I saw him on um, Jay Styles' video too, man. That place looks sick. Boom. All right. This side complete. Death Rock said good evening Jeez. from Las Vegas. Las Vegas? I've never been out there. Ice Cube Connecticut said the phone cord is to connect the seat post battery. Oh, okay. 
Look at this. Yeah, you guys are probably gonna have to help me build this. This is crazy. Uh oh. Turn, turn around. Every now and then I get a... I'm trying to figure this out. Um, lift it. Cut the rest off the other side. There we go. Get this over here. Is this still stuck? Yep. All right, now I gotta hold this with one hand. <laughs> get over here. Yeah. What else we got? We got a Yaday day bike. I didn't unbox that yet. Uh, there's possibly a dirt bike coming soon. That's going to be cool. I, I Scoot said the phone cord is to connect the seat toast battery. Yep. Oh, yeah. yep. Joe the Toast said, I'm still at entry level 25, 30 miles an hour e-scooter. I was looking around to upgrade and bumped into that place. Was beyond my level. LOL. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Them, them guys love fast. Fast, fast, fast. Oh, we have Jeff Morneau in the chat. What's up, Jeff? How you doing, brother? Um, he said, keep the great videos coming. You guys live in your best life. Loving it, loving it. We yeah, just, we have to meet up soon, Jeff. Let us know when you're down. We just had a group ride here recently. Uh, Bomber Marv brought his 90 plus mile an hour bandit. We got to check that out. I only got to ride it like a little bit and not fast because that thing is way too scary for me. And the turning radius isn't like a lot. So it was very scary. <laughs> But he hit 91 miles an hour that day. I did put a little short on my YouTube and on, did I put it on Instagram yet? I don't know if I put it on Instagram yet. The short um, or the real. Yes, you just Barbara looked Marv, up. like zooming by me. I'm like, oh my God. Yeah, did you guys see the Instagram reel he put up of the 91 mile an hour e-bike? Yo, Bomber Marv is crazy. Oh, and, and then uh, on that group ride too, um, what came the rev ride one up rev one came uh derek brought that and his battery died farmer marv towed him back home and like at 50 miles an hour on a side of route one it was crazy that was insane oh and we also we went in the woods to this awesome section that i was we always ride to and it was like a section that was like growing in so people followed me some people didn't follow me the people didn't follow me went the right way the people that followed me kept their legs down while I put my feet up on my Surhan and uh, Feedy was there and he was ripping through that stuff going like back and forth. We stopped at that little beach part and Feedy looked at his leg and it was covered in thousands of really small ticks. It was so crazy. So once he noticed everybody looked down, their legs were just covered in these itty bitty super small ticks. It was crazy. I didn't, I didn't think there was going to be that many ticks. I didn't even know. The grass was growing in there like that on the on the trail, so that was pretty cool. Uh, some lady called the cops on us for having the the uh, our bikes on the trail, saying, "Oh, you can't have those types of bikes on the trail." And we were going like 12 miles an hour on the bike trail till we got off the trail, and then um, yeah, we were even getting passed by like regular road bikes on the trail. So I don't even know, you know, what the problem is. I'm sure. I guess if you don't know anything about e-bikes and you see like Surrounds, they look kind of intimidating. All right. What else do we got to do next? Is What are you doing over there, Didi? A pole? Yeah. <laughs> okay. I think I'm going to do what I always do. So I'm going to put the handlebars on first, tighten them down a little bit, flip the bike upside down, get the tire on. Uh, what, hold on. What's this? Oh, the headlight. Oh, snap. Don't fall. Oh, Joe Hamilton said those letters meant Springfield, Illinois. Ah, gotcha. Mike L B D E. <laughs> Lewis Beach. I don't know. <laughs> Mike Morgan, a trailer that doesn't bounce and flip over is the trick. Well, I'm sure he's gonna put it to the test. We'll Should I throw it on the Suron? <laughs> Pop some wheelies on this thing. ISQ Connecticut, the only thing Ooh, really different for down. assembly is that you have to attach the saddle to the seat post battery. Unlock and pull out or raise the seat post to make it easier. So you got to actually, hold on, is he saying you got to take the whole seat out to get the battery out? Oh, there's a power button right there. You have to attach the saddle to the seat post battery. Okay. Unlock and pull out or raise the seat post to make it easier. So it's, is it easy to like yank it out by the seat, like with this little hole? Is that for in case you got those hemorrhoids? <laughs> oh, actually, I don't even know. People, 
people probably do something. It's an know. event. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Or or other things. Why are there holes? In I don't. I don't. I don't know. I, I think you're right. That is like a vent. Keep um, your biscuits nice. Blue knows that I like these Angways X24 and X26. They are sold out until mid September in the what? UK. Oh, Darn. in the UK. I wonder what the top speed of this one is here. It's, uh, I wish you UK guys could have freaking throttles and 30 mile an hour. Although I think people like don't care and you guys still do it like we do here in the US. We're just like, yeah, we'll do it. Shoebox said, I'm out of Jersey. Big up to Powerful Lithium. My bike wasn't ready this year. The Mega Ride 2024. I'll be there. Love what you guys are doing. Let's go. In Austin, Mega Ride, I'm going to try my damnness to make that one. But there's an Electrify Expo, what, like the month after, the month before? And I want to try to make it to that too. So, yeah, so last That's a lot year, of traveling. the Mega Ride was the same week as the Austin Electrify Expo. Yep. Now they are over a month apart. So yeah. Freddie is trying to figure out which one should he go to, guys. Which one do you want him to go to? Yeah, should we vote? Expo or the Mega Ride? Do you want me to go to the Austin Expo at the Circuit of the Americas where they're going to be renting part of the the racetrack where I can take the, the actual electric cars on and, motor, and electric motorcycles, or go to the Sura Mega Ride where there'll be like over 200 electric dirt bikes just ripping around, having a good time for three days. Should we have a poll for that too? Are we polling it up? And guys, don't forget to stick around for the end of the video where I do have these two boxes to unbox, a product that you guys will probably like if you have a Super 73. Uh, I'm hoping this thing doesn't fall and I feel like it's gonna fall. Uh, it's weird when you're doing stuff backwards. There you go. KR e-bike said, this old lady said, slow down, LOL. And we almost got stuck in the sand. <laughs> so you were on the ride? <laughs> What's oh, your the name? sand, the sand one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The sa yeah. That's where the, the freaking bugs were. Freaking ticks, man. Those things bug me out, man. I hate ticks so much. I only had a few, luckily, because I was, I saw the tall grass. I was like, oh no, I should have just stopped dead in my tracks like I normally do. But I think we were just having so much fun that day, just ripping around. But luckily I pulled up my feet. I was like, no, no. You guys want to see what he's doing? Want me to get closer? I, I'm just having a hard time getting these little, uh, Suckers a grab. I just want a few threads grabbing on each so I can just start turning. How's the Over. how's the light? So you crisscross, right? Yeah, I'm trying to get some threads grabbing over here, which I don't think I even I think I got one grab. Joe the Toast said, I came from the comedy side of YouTube, but ran into an e-scooter, and it had me at hello. <laughs> Here I am today on a shreddy live, and wish it was three years earlier. We love, love riding these things. It's crazy that the people you meet riding e-bikes, like people from all, all breeds of life, so love shreddy, and ride e-bikes. Shreddy is unboxing a fast Segway electric scooter next week. What? Transformers. Transformers. Um, Megatron one, too. Who loves Megatron? Optimus Prime or, or Megatron? What do you guys, what do you guys choose? KR e-bike said, put the front wheel on first, then let the bike lean on the kickstand. I'm just getting this straight on. Boop, boop, boop. Um, I, w I wish I could have Dee Dee help me put the tire on. Cause I could just lift the front and then have her roll the tire on. Boop, drop it. But you, you know what? I'm going to show you guys how to do it. The, what? what? Joe the Toe said, I will build my own e-scooter one day and call it Tornado T. Tornado, <laughs> hell yeah. I love that. Where, where does the Joe the Toe uh, nickname come from? Do you have like something going on with your toe or you got an extra toe <laughs> or something growing up? That'd be sick. I knew, so, I knew a girl in Puerto Rico uh, when I went to school there. She had an extra thumb. So she could have been like, I don't know. Uh, Juanita the thumb or something. <laughs> they used to say six fingers were witches. What? Right? <laughs> I don't know. I never heard that. I don't know much about like witch stories. 
ISQ Connecticut said the top speed should be 31 to 33 miles per hour, but only for three minutes. Then it automatically goes back oh, to regular breaks. mode. What? So it has like a boost, like a little baby boost. Like, here we go. Gotcha. I guess they don't want you to burn out the motors, burn out the controllers. Uh, I hope the rear is on this side. You know what? I'm scared. Oh, that just freaked me out. I thought both pedals were facing exactly down, which was not the story. Oh, don't crush that light. Don't crush that light. Whoa. Get that over there. Ah, much easier. Much easier to put on the tire like this for me. Uh. Any questions, guys? Any questions? Videos, past videos, recent videos, e-bikes that I own, e-bikes that are coming, e-bikes that I haven't unboxed yet. About this. Joe OSW said, looks like there's plenty of room for a third battery. A triangle battery will fit right underneath the top tube. Oh yeah, if we, if we let Bomber Marv have this thing for like two days, this thing would be going like 120 miles an hour. It'd have like a 100 amp hour battery. <laughs> Crazy. You guys are gonna freak out when you see Marv's freaking spark bandit. He needs, he needs to upgrade his swing arm though for sure. Iscoot said there's no front fender in case you think it's missing. <laughs> Dude, this is on tight, bro. Brah. Yo, this is crazy. D, what? Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Do it on the inside. Let's see what he's struggling with, guys. <laughs> struggling with Shreddy. There we go. I've never seen it like that where they tighten up then with the ones on the inside and the outside. Grab it, B. Jeez. I've never had one of these that tight, guys. Come on. Come on, Angway. Don't tighten it up that way. Unless I'm just weak. Get out. Get get out. Hold on, do I need this? Is that needed? Right? Nope. Uh, nope. There we go. There we go. We got it. We got it. We got it. So yeah, what else happened on that group ride, D? We got some good food. We ate on the water. Uh, the, the lady did call the cops on us, but the cops never got us because they were probably just laughing at her. Uh, she was recording. I think it, it was her. There was some lady recording when we right when we got to the trail. So it's like she got the memo, like these e-bikers are coming. Ah. But I don't know. I don't know. Oh, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm sitting here talking, <laughs> rambling on, not putting the tire on. Pull this little guy out of here. Make sure you pull that guy out of there. Joe the Toast said, LOL, I saw Shreddy with a Kill Tony shirt. Hey. He, I be, he, I, you it. might have seen Toei in that live that's doing live content. Say that again? Oh, he said his name's Joe the Toe because Joe Rogan looks like a human thumb and Joe rhymes with toe. Oh. <laughs> that's awesome. Love it. Shoebox said prime all day. Oh, yeah. What is that? Joe the Toe said when the cops took my fingerprints, my thumbs look like... Joe Rogan. <laughs> Joe Rogan's <laughs> face. <laughs> Ice Cube said the entire X series is really tall. My X26 is going to be even taller. All right. I'm excited to try this thing out. I want to know what this like whole boost button thing is. If that's what uh, if that's what it is, the boost button. I don't know what's going on here. It looks like there's like these little, they like latch in, but I don't see where they lock into to tell you the truth. It doesn't have any like where to grab. Let me pull this all the way off. I'm just laughing that you brought your, your new computer to show them your laptop. I'm so happy. It's like in the video. I'm happy. Like. Can Shreddy be happy? He got a laptop. Hmm. Are these just here, just to be here? 
Ice Cube says, Angway Factory made this dummy front axle extra tight so Shreddy would struggle. Yeah, what's going on here? And they actually have these little guys. You know, these, you know, they like supposed to have a little hole from them to grab into. I don't see like anywhere where they would grab like inside or outside. Oops, sorry, I just kicked. Yeah, there's the camera. Let's see. Normally what these want. like latch into something, but there's like no hole here or no hole here. So I don't know. Maybe read the instructions? Maybe not. Maybe. Let's see if it fits without any of this. Okay, it fits without any of it. So maybe we'll just do. Let me put that on that side right quick. Let me see what happens. The hook washers go on the outside and the hook faces downwards, I Scoot said. Oh, let's see. But it looks like it's, it's, it's just, it'll be free, like free spinning. Joe said, I'm looking more into bikes as well. Too cool to ignore. Oh, now it's like locked in there. The struggle continues. I don't want to not have my locking washers in there. End up losing a front tire while I'm riding down some stairs. You guys know what I do. All right, so we'll keep the ones on the inside. Did, what did he say on the inside or outside? Outside. Okie dokie. And he said they face upwards. Downwards? Downwards. Yeah, see, look how tight that is. What in the world? Hmm. It, it was so easy for it to go in without it, right? But with them, it's like, no deals. The struggle continues. Watch it go in and pinch the hell out of me. Yes, look how tight that is. There's no way. There's no way. Look at that. I don't want to, like, force it. But man, I feel like that's not meant to be. Maybe we'll just do the outside ones. That's kind of weird. That's what they said. Boom. They said just the outside facing downwards. Oh, I thought you said both. <laughs> D. I'm just kidding. Thank you, guys. <laughs> Struggling <laughs> with Shreddy. I just don't want this to fall. Like. It looks like your shirt glows in the dark. Off, does it? I'm not sure if it does or not. I need some water. I'm starting to get sweaty. Swe struggling with sweaty, shreddy. How about that? Let's get some agua. Agua, agua. We'll tighten these down. Mike Morgan said the frame with seat post batteries makes sense if it's fairly waterproof. Good weight balance. Oh yeah, we're gonna have to straighten. KR Bike those said how many watts, how many volts? We're gonna look at the specs after we get it all built up. Built it up. 1,000 watts, 48 volts, I scoot said. Nice. Did they give me right tools for this? Bill Hamilton was thinking of doing a local off-road trail, but after the tick story, probably not. Bro, the ticks were the worst. They say tuck your pants into your socks. Well, after we got out of the trail, there was a sign saying that the place was swarming with ticks. <laughs> So, I feel like I, I wish I had two of the 15s. I can tighten them at the same time. My horse time. said the torque to stop is almost the same as stopping. What is it? The torque to stop is almost the same as stopping. Twos. Yeah. Hollywood Sean. Hey, bud. What's Love up, Hollywood videos. Sean? Love the videos, too. What's your take on the... Jason, electric bike, 48 volt, 12.8, etc. I haven't seen that one or even tried it. But the only Jason I had was, I forget the name of the Jason. It was a white one. You still have it? Uh, nope. There was a, remember we did a giveaway a long time ago with them? I wonder how many Newton meters of torque that was. Okay, so 
kickstand is next. I'm gonna put the kickstand on, flip the sucker around. Uh, we'll figure out. Ice Scoot's gonna help us out with the battery <laughs> situation here. Uh, okay. You guys hear me still pretty good, DD? Got your mic on? All right. Can you guys hear DD pretty well? How's the pole going over there? Dime bag coins, good, good. What Ooh, up, dime bag? Shreddy. There you are. How you doing, brother? Never mind. Shredhead member said, Shreddy, did you get to try out the Chimera BMX at the expo? I did, and I have a video of that also coming very soon. And Mike Feedy actually brought it to the show. He'll he'll be shooting out a review of that one out pretty soon. He bunny hot me on that. He freaking bunny hot me. Like me, laying on the ground. Did this just go? What the hell? I went down my pants. Sunday is winning and Saturday is in second place for the next video. Oh, Sunday. Okay. What time Sunday? Oh, okay, you guys? here we go. Yeah. Should we do it early morning, afternoon, later in the evening? Yeah, you guys comment in the live chat what time would you want to see this on Sunday? Early in the morning, later in the day, afternoon. Whatever Shreddy just said. Yeah. Anytime you want. All right, did I get one on? Okay, our e-bike yeah, said evening. On. Good evening. Good evening. Wow. Hollywood Sean, what's go. the most expensive electric or e-bike to date? To date? I don't know. That's a that's a good question. I might have to research that. Must be one uh, an electric motorcycle, maybe. <laughs> Maybe like Porsche? Yeah. If Porsche has a... Oh, what's going on here? Oh, we got 13. Hold on, is there like a backing to this? What's going on here? What is going on here? Oh, oh, I know, this goes behind it. Yeah, everyone's saying evening. Yeah, there we go. Dimebag Coins, do you have a favorite big guy bike yet? Big guy bike would probably be something like the uh, Aero Rider Grizzly or the Spark Cycle Works Bandit or the Suron. <laughs> but you gotta get, actually, you probably have to get an extended frame for that. What about the new Zeus? Oh yeah, the new Zeus 1200. Guys, if you guys didn't see the review on that, I, I do have a review of the new Zeus if you guys are interested in that. Um, there's links down below for everything. This is the Angway X24 if you guys are interested. I think they have $100 going off right now. Click that link down below. If you this, make your purchase through that if this video is helping you. This bike's weight is up to 330 pounds. Is it really? You, you, this can says. hold 330 pounds? That's what it says on their website. Damn, son. So, yeah. All of the electric bike discount links are in the video's description. So, I'm pretty sure the pedal or the kickstand goes behind here and then you screw it in. Ow, that was sharp. I almost sliced my freaking finger, D. <laughs> what did? This little screw has like a little rim around it. It's like, it was sharp on this one. Oh, Mike Morgan said, I meant the acceleration to speed is almost the same to stop when brakes are concerned. Are you talking about this bike? <laughs> What's going on? What bike are you talking about, Mike? This one? There we go. Has to be like this, Who right? knows? Tesla's bringing out an e-bike next year. Uh-oh. That'd be pretty cool. I'd love to see what, what they come up with. KR e-bike said the Recon Stealth Bomber costs 17000 from Cab Motorworks. Wow. Sounds like it's fast. <laughs> Is that like a hub drive, too? Direct drive? Dime bag coin said, what about the Frigo? It is lighter, more lightly built than those other oh, bikes. Oh yeah, the F, I forgot about the F3 Pro. Yeah, if you're if you're in for a budget bike, the Frigo F3 Pro, but I, I I see the the prices are raising up a lot more since my review. If you guys are interested in a Frigo F3 Pro, there is a link down below to save hundred dollars off. Things like code Shreddy. But any bike on the channel, if you guys have any questions about them, let me know. Uh, and if you guys are enjoying this video, this fun little live review up until, or live unboxing up until now, definitely, don't forget to hit that like button. Let's get this shared out to people and get some more people joining this 
live stream. We'll probably be doing a few more live streams in the next what, couple days. We have uh, the Transformers scooter to open up. We got a, uh, what is it? Rad the Rad Power, Power the trailer for it, the little Yadea. center console, console for it. Oh yeah, the Yaday bike. I think it's Yadea or Yaday. And that, that thing's pretty much just like the Ride One Up Rev One. It kind of looks like that one. Um, we got seat, we got pedals. And I guess that's it. What's the poles looking like? Sunday one. I'm gonna start a new one. Show you guys the pedals. Boom, boom. Oh, geez, tripping with Shreddy. All right, so the left side will be on this side, the right side is on this side. Um, I'll just like just put it in. Hold it until you feel a little resistance and you can grab a, one of these wrenches, whichever one it is. Let's go around in circles, guys. There we go. Nope, not that one. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, it's that one over there. Get out of here. <laughs> God, there we go, there we go. What, um, is there a bike you guys want me to open up next? Do you guys want the scooter next or the Rad Power? Transformer scooter or Rad Power unboxing next? What should we do? <laughs> this thing, that's a big old cord. Ring! Hello, y'all, what's up, though? Hollywood show, my bike's been out of commission for three months. I ride with a bunch of college student friends here in Savannah, Georgia. Nice. Where are you guys from? Lewis, Delaware. We're from Lewis Beach, Delaware. East Coast, baby. I want to go to Savannah, Georgia to a ghost tour. Oh, yeah, ghost tours are fun. And I want to go to Charleston. We're hoping to do a lot of traveling this winter, stay in the warm, warm places. But we'll travel through the cold places to get to the warm places. And we'll do some group rides. Uh, Dimebag Point says, is the P51 good for big guys? The P51, what, what what was uh the weight on that one? I don't know. It looks really well built though. Yeah, um, the, it's super freaking comfortable though. That freaking ride is so yeah, cushy. Um, check out. Oh, this thing. You can check oh. out P51 in the link in the, this video's description. It should be What's down going there. On here? Oh. If it's not there, we can add it. But that might be good as well. That's a really Ooh. nice looking bike. Got a staple. And Eddie has what, $100 off code or $150 off? Oh, I can't remember. I think it's like, might be 100 or 150. Uh, Use code Shreddy. Ooh, I think, I don't know if that's gonna. We might have to go through the link though, so we'll post it. Tell me if it's gonna hit. Uh, oh, snap. <laughs> oh, this is always scary to do. Okay, brakes work. Rear brakes on the right. You guys know I love my rear brake on the left. I wonder if this thing would be easy to wheelie. What do you guys think? You think I could wheelie this thing? Guess we're gonna find out. What do you guys think about the bike, the look of it? It does look like a like a moped. Like mountain bike-ish. Looks cool. I don't even know what to say. We don't know yet. We don't have the seat on yet. And uh, we don't have that little back piece on. So this right here is a battery and then in here we got a battery. That's pretty cool. Stealthy battery. Um, I don't know if I, I want to do the back seat first, I guess. I hope we have tools still. Uh, back to Capilot said, are you a fan of moped style bikes? Me? Hell yeah, <laughs> definitely. Um, was there supposed to be like screws or something? Or was that just like click in? Clicked in. <laughs> Hmm? <laughs> yeah, I think it just like clicks in or something. Bird Dog said, hello friends. Bong, What's up? Bong hits. Hell yeah. Then he said, this guy, lol. What guy? <laughs> Who, me? <laughs> Who, me? Nah, never. Time back coins. I like the way Zeus did the rear suspension. Was there any downside yeah. to the way they did those rear shocks? Uh, I, I put on the stiff shocks, so... 
I didn't get to test out both shocks yet, so I don't, I don't know what the other ones feel like, but so far the stiff shocks are good for what I like to do is jumping around, popping the wheelies. Um, I wish I knew what the, the softer shocks felt like. I thought they did come in the box and I couldn't find them, so maybe I can get them to ship me out one. Where did that go? Dude? Where'd it go? Here it is. Uh, ship me out one. A pair of those softer springs on there but dude that's got to be like one of my top three favorite bikes right now just for how much fun i'm having wheelie in it right now it's like literally the easiest bike to wheelie so freaking much fun so much fun where's the little guy where's the little mike dude? morgan are you talking about this bike that uh shardy's unboxing is that the bike you're talking about what, what's the question the torque to speed is almost the same to stop distributed over two wheels so the front forks have to be ready so we do have like full front fork suspension. We got a rear suspension. It looks like the- Yeah, this has triple suspension. The rear has a spot you can put your shock pump on there to pump it up a little bit more. Uh, the front, it looks like you do have adjustment for preload. I'll just mess with the light later, that light. I'll tighten it up later. Yeah, compression and preload adjustment. Oh, <laughs> I forgot oh to tighten that God. down. <laughs> Oh, it's like totally all the way stiff. Okay, that feels good. I'll, I'll have to mess with that here soon, tighten that down, get it to my liking. Looks like I gotta bring up the display, hook up the display, arrow to arrow. Mike Morgan said those there three springs on the back look really impressive, adjustability. Yeah, I do, got, I do have a shock pump too. I forgot to take that off. They feel really, really stiff right now, as is. I'm wondering if they even have pressure in it. Um, my Aero Rider didn't have any air in it at all, and they still felt a little bit stiff, but I don't know, maybe I can see how much air we got in there. Back to Cablat said, nice, nice. Ice Cube said, there is one screw on the bottom of the rear seat that holds it from sliding back out. Bird Dog said he wants to see the Segway GT Megatron unbox. GT Megatron's coming. I, I might have to do that unboxing in the garage because that thing is heavy. Unless I can get a neighbor to come help me out and grab that uh, box inside. Man, that thing is heavy. And I'd, I'd rather do the unboxing inside. So what, what happens here? Dimebag Coin said, oh, this is the triple suspension bike. Maybe I should look at the instructions because I have no idea how this seat goes on. Is this the first bike you've had that's triple suspension? No, I see what's going on here. I just got to figure out how to unscrew. These guys like screw these on there so freaking tight, dude. I feel like, is there a bigger one than 15? We got a 17, there we go. Shorty, is this the there first bike you've had with triple suspension? The Aero Rider Grizzly pretty much has the same setup. Uh, Spark Cycle Work Bandit have pretty much the same setup. Remember, I have the gold ones that look like this. And any other bikes? Bird Dog said a friend of mine has this bike. It's cool. Amelia Soquero, hey. Help me. How do I take this guy out? <laughs> What's up, Emilio? <laughs> Instead of saying hi, you said help me. <laughs> help me. Emilio, help me. I feel like I gotta unscrew this, attach it to the seat, get the seat like totally, totally attached. Oh, Shreddy, you'll have to try to fold the bike, they said. Oh man, do I have to? <laughs> you guys wanna watch me struggle, or, don't you? Or you can wait for the review. You guys, I'll do it, I'll do it for you. I, oh. Shh. Bird Dog said hello from Northern New York, bong hits for everyone. Bong hits. <laughs> <Hello>. <laughs> Love it, dude. All right, so usually to get seats on, you gotta do some kind of crazy thing like this. Some kind of setup. I'm not sure if, if this goes on top or on bottom. I'm kind of just like guessing. This goes down here, maybe. Like that. Amelia said, I wish I could help you. Somebody come here and help, bro. Hollywood Sean said, My birthday is next Tuesday. This I'm 29 on the 29th. Hell yeah. Happy birthday. Early birthday. 
I don't know if this goes this way, Dave. I'm not sure. Oh, here we go again, guys. It needs your help. <laughs> when the struggle continues, you are struggling with Shreddy. Amelia said it's my birthday today. What? Oh, that's right. We said happy, happy birthday. birthday. That's right. Hold up. What's going on here? Oh, I'm being dumb. I got it now. I got it. I'll see it. I see. It's going to go underneath here, the battery. Yeah, I just said there's one screw on the bottom of the rear seat that holds it on from sliding back. Oh, that's a different seat. <laughs> he needs help with the seat, too. Yo, this is going to be crazy. I don't even know how I'm going to do this. I just said pull the seat post up or out to tighten the saddle back on. Oh, looks like you're going to unlock it. What the hell? Do I need like a key? Ow! Ooh! No. What happened? I, my knees get like on tools. Tools on knees. Oh, I need that. I need key. I need keys. All right. Here's the, here's the keys for that battery, I guess. I had no clue. There we go. Mike Feedy, hey! What up, Feedy? Put the screw into the post and then attach the plates. Yeah! Yeah! Dang, look at this battery. What? Oh, it's got a light on it. That's cool. All right. Put the screw into the post and then attach the plates. Thanks, Mike. <laughs> You're the best. Should that one go on first? Or does this one go on first? This one goes on first. This one goes here. This goes here, like there, right? Am I doing this right? I hope so. There we go. And my feet is like Grandpa Eddie. <laughs> <laughs> the struggle, bro. This is awesome. I skip said there's a circular key to unlock the seat. Am I late with that comment? <laughs> Got it. Thank you. Hollywood Sean said, Rad Bike 2, how fast, how many voltage? What did they say earlier? Like almost 30 and there's like some kind of power boost? Like 33 miles an hour, possibly power boost, it's long range, triple suspension. Yeah, this is like the hardest seat ever Mike to said put it on. looks right from what he sees. Come on, just... Just get in the hole. Just get in the hole. Come on. I think I got it in the hole. All right, there we go. Got it. Freaking did it. I freaking did it. I freaking did it. Yes. Hold on. Don't move. Stay still. Yes. Yes. I'm getting sweaty. I'm getting sweaty. <laughs> the struggle. Damn, I didn't think we we're going to have a struggle with Shreddy today, but. Uh, I didn't let you guys down, I guess. Figure out where, where I should have it on that little rail. Yeah, I was just gonna say, how do you know where to put it? <laughs> That's what she said. He tighten that sucker on there. You ain't going anywhere. Ever. My feetie said, "Sweaty Eddie." Sweaty shreddy. Uh, there we go. This thing is heavy. You can freaking back out. It looks like it's like a person. Amelia like, said, love hey the guys. hat, Shreddy. Oh, I'll struggle with Shreddy. So right. you guys, what is the hole in the bike seat for? <laughs> I think it's for this. Oh, 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 there we go. Yeah. And then you can adjust. D can sit back here, dude. D can sit back. You can definitely sit back here. Battery turns on like that. You lock it like so. Make sure. Yep. This is a cool oh, bike. this like clicks that. in first. Hold on, sorry guys. We gotta unlock it. Click that in. Then lock it. Oh, Shredhead members in the chat, Brian McCann. What's up, Brian McCann? How you doing, brother? Good to see you. This is the Engway X24. Since you're just arriving, um, 
we had a slight struggle, so you miss a little bit of a struggle with Shreddy. Um, you could always rewinding up, rewind it about five minutes and have fun watching me struggle. Um, let me tighten this down since now I have it pretty much adjusted to the point where I want it. We'll fold <laughs> this damn bike. We still have two boxes to unbox here. Got some surprise unboxings. I got to do a video with the top box here very soon. Um, so stick around for that. It's a power upgrade for an e-bike. Mike Feedy said the hole on the bike seat is used to reduce stress on the... Gonads? Yes. <laughs> on the gazongas? He said something else. <laughs> uh, oh, when you it, check it in It rhymes nuts. with um, coal. <laughs> oh, like basketballs? <laughs> yeah, and then it rhymes with... Um, I don't even know what rhymes with Rhymes with, with butts? Nuts? No. No. <laughs> packs. <laughs> Rhymes with packs. Sacks? <laughs> yeah. Potato sacks? <laughs> yeah, basketball packs. All right, we're going to ride this down some freaking stairs. I'm definitely riding this downstairs. Ryan McCann said, I just saw you're on. YouTube didn't notify me again. What the hell? YouTube hates me, dude. I swear. Glad you could join, Brian. All right. What else we got? Headlight. What's up? <laughs> You said the seat looks messed up, question mark. It's Hold on. facing a weird direction. Why is it facing down? It's facing down. <sighs> Amelia, what's the I know how to there? tilt it. Yeah, I just got to loosen it up and kind of rock it backwards. I'm not messing with the seat. I'm done with that seat. The temperature today was 79 degrees. And it was humid, though, in the morning, but then it got really hot at night. Oh, no, no, no. It was humid and it got cold at night. Sorry. What's the temperature where you guys are? It's like 70 degrees now here. Chronicles of Teleria, I'm late to the party. Chronicles, what's up, bro? This is the Angway X24. Had a little bit of a struggle with Shreddy. Nothing too, too crazy. <laughs> Nothing crazy, guys. My feet is saying, say it. And then he wrote it again. Sax? B A L L L L S A C K K. There's a guy in a band called Balzac. Oh my god, now Bird Dog said the gummies are kicking in. He's doing everything over there. <laughs> yeah, send, <laughs> send some to Shreddy, bro. Jeez, you guys are leaving me out me. of the fun. Well, really? I, need a, I need a P.O. box so you guys can send me stuff. Yeah. Amelia said it's 100 here. Where are you? Jesus. Are you in Cali? We're trying to go there. Yeah, it's 9 o'clock here, too. Brian McCann, Shreddy, did you see the LN Motion RS scooter? No, I didn't. Send me a link. No, but he'll be unboxing the Segway Transformer scooter this week. 45 miles an hour. That thing's like a freaking power horse, dude. Hollywood Sands, Georgia's weather's bipolar. We're doing it in the back. Hot and humid. Am I putting it from the back Same side? here. Always humid. Always Amelia humid. Amelia was in East Missouri Coast, and it's humid. 100. Oh, Eddie, I saw your yeah, mom Missouri. in Austin. It's 100 down there, too. Yeah, she said it's been nice and hot over there. She's in Campner, Campner, Texas. He said it hasn't rained in weeks in Georgia. Georgia. So what do you guys think about this bike? So far, I dig it. I feel like I don't want to keep screwing light bulbs in. <laughs> finishing this later for you guys because this is probably not fun to watch. Like but... Eddie mentioned at the beginning of the video too. He said, gang, I gotta go. My async video will be up tomorrow. Hell yeah. Let's go. Amelia so whoa. Uh Hollywood Sean, cool beans. Amelia Socorro, nice bike. Yeah, what was that movie where they kept on they made up the cool beans song? They're like cool beans, cool, 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 cool beans, cool beans. Anybody remember? No idea. <laughs> cool no beans. idea about a song with cool beans. Cool, 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 cool beans. Cool beans. The Chronicles of Teleria. I survived the California hurricane a couple days ago. Our trash can tipped over. <laughs> Dude, you guys got crazy weather this weekend? Like, what the hell? I heard there was a hurricane and an earthquake in California. Hurricane Hillary? Yeah. Is that it? I Scoot said, FYI, the extra yarn was just a leftover, not enough to make anything with. Oh, I thought you were telling us something like, you guys got to learn. That <laughs> <laughs> you're telling us, you got to learn now. Like, damn, I, I never learned how to do hey, that. Hey, we could make like a baby hat with it. A bunch of my friends have babies. <laughs> yeah, I've never ever seen you 
Make Good anything? Up. No, hey, not that. I, I used to make those um, pot holders back in the day <laughs> with the yarn. Oh, and you used to make me cakes and, and cupcakes. Yeah, I made them cakes, cupcakes. That's pretty cool. All right, struggle. You want to see me struggle and open this damn thing? I made him electric guitar cake. Uh, let me get a little bit of water here. UFC cake. Oh, yeah. Made the UFC now cake. Now he needs the lightning bolt cake. Yeah, like electric e-bike cake. I don't know. Bird Dog said, nice bike. Is class too oh. much by sleeper? Change my mind. How do you hook this up? Where does this go? Like up in the Bird rear? Bird Dog, cover this. Oh, this I see. Segway GT2. Oh, I we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. I wonder if I should like wrap it like this. Kind of keep it out the way type daily. Bird Dog said no hat. What's that? <laughs> you want me to take off my hat? <laughs> I agree. They can't see your face. I'm sorry. Shoebox said hydrated. Cheers, homie. Um, Emilio, Cheers. where did you get that hat, Shreddy? You, uh, guys, you guys know, right? Shover? He got a special package in the mail. No, I got this from Shove. Oh, I thought that was new. No, no, but um, Drew Loves did send me some stuff. I got pegs now. I've been actually learning how to wheelie with the pegs on my Super 73. Um, that's pretty fun, but it's, it's kind of hard figuring out the balance on that. I'll get it down soon. I got some shirts. What else? A bunch of stickers. So it's hats from Chris Shelver. You guys know him. Yep. Ooh, I'm over tightening. <laughs> Hollywood Sean. We're trying to get Chris back out here. <laughs> He's coming soon again. Shoebox said, let's go. There we go. Now we're plugged in. Both batteries. Actually, do I have to... Uh, nah, I don't have to plug that battery. I see said, the front battery is always on. The seat post battery has a button to turn it on. Oh, okay. So if this battery is always on, if you don't want it to slowly drain, you might want to pull it out. Um, I'm going to keep the, pet, the kickstand on. All right, hold on. Sometimes these have like some kind of like thing you click in. Let me turn it around. This thing is big, guys. Oh, it's heavy too. It's heavy. We'll figure out the weight here soon too. I think D has all the specs. Oh, they actually put a lot of air in the tires already. All right. There we go. Oh, there we go. Folding it up. Yeah. The, the, the seat's coming up. When you... I'm not that good at folding these damn bikes. I'm, I'm sure there's like easier steps to do it. Yes, Amelia said, I love the color. I like the color too. That's about as small as it gets. I'm guessing if you're going to travel with it, you could always take the handlebars off. That's probably what I would do, take the handlebars off when you're traveling with something like this. That would fit in a trunk. I don't know if we could fit trunk. this in, in your car. Yeah, not sure. it would. Not sure. And that's it sideways. It's a good bike if you guys have apartments, mm -hmm. portable. Do we have tape measure? Trunks. Tape measure. I see some tape measure. How much? Um, you can use. I think there is a link down. D, do you have the, uh, all the specs Spec? over there? I just want to see like how long it is. There is a link down below. I think they have a hundred dollars off going on. Um, so I'm gonna Check out the link in the video's description. Here to here is about 39 inches. And then I'm going to do from the bottom tire. So let's say like the stem. It's about 37 inches. And let me do cross about 37 inches. So 39, 37, 37. I mean, and how how wide okay, is Okay, so it the then? price is about 17 and a half or about 17 inches wide like that. The price is 18.99 and if you use Shreddy's link in the video's description for this bike it is $17.99, so that gives you $100 off and for a limited it. time only. And this color is the black, and it comes in Ooh, gray also. That's just sparked because the battery is always on. So don't fold it until the battery is off, you guys. Yep. It just sparked. I'm sure if we have the key down here, normally you can turn it off with, the, with these keys. Like you can click the battery onto the off position. Um... Actually, let me see. This is the Angue X24. X24. Yep. So this is the 24 inch tire. It comes in 22 and 26 also. And this one's a 48 volt. Oh, it comes in X20, 
X24 or X26. Where's the keyhole for, the for this battery? So this is the X Engway X24. I don't see the keyhole. 24 inch tires. For the battery. Fat tire foldable electric bike. Oh, look at the, it has suspension down here too. Is that why you were saying triple? Okay. Triple suspension. I didn't see that. That's pretty cool. HLT 100, 750 pound says on there. Do you guys know where the key for the battery is? Was, was it like actually in there? Inside, in here maybe, I wonder. Cause that's kind of weird. Like the battery would always be on. You should be able to click it off so it doesn't do like that spark. I'm not liking that spark. Now you guys, if you use um, Shreddy's link below, it takes you to Angway's website. Got that on. All right, for hundred dollars off. Batteries on, anyways. So he got the bike from Engway's website. You get it for a hundred dollars off. I'll Check tilt that link in the video's description. That seat back later. Did that? What? You want to go over some of the specs? Oh, the light actually turns red with the bike powered off. Okay. Yeah, let me check that out. Let's look at the specs while I uh, feel this out. <laughs> the seat is pointed down so freaking far, guys. That's crazy. So don't forget, we did come with a 3 amp chargers, 48 volt uh, e bike. Let's see the X series specs. Here we go. So the metal is 6061 aluminum alloy, 20 by uh, 20. Four by four inch tires, 1200 watt peak on this motor, 750 watt motor, 70 newton meters of torque. It's a 48 volt, 19.2 amp hour battery, which is the first one. And then this one down here is a 48 volt, 10 amp hour lithium ion battery. Speed is from zero to 31. And from what I scoot said, I think it's only for like a small peak for the 31 miles an hour. Their mileage is about 62 miles, and I'm sure that's probably an eco mode or like a pedal assist one just pedaling this sucker. Uh, charging time is about eight hours of fully charged both batteries. It would be super sick if they did supply two chargers so you can cut that in half. We do have hydraulic disc brakes, which is really awesome to have. Uh, hub power spoke motor with 1000 watts of power, Shimano eight gears. The bike does weigh 92.3 pounds. I'm, pretty sure with all the batteries in it it doesn't say what it weighs when you take the batteries out actually uh, no hold on it says bike weight 92.3 pounds gross weight is 108.7 pounds I'm not sure what they're saying on there is that with the batteries maximum load which is pretty crazy 330 pound uh, weight capacity on this e-bike so that was for the x24 um, let's figure out how to get this sucker on oh the controls are over here Oh, we got the thumb throttle on the left side. I usually like that on the right, but maybe you it'll make that easier. You always say that though. That's how most companies do to it. To wheel it. Uh, most companies have it right here on oh, this really? side. Yep. So, let's uh, like the power buttons over here on the left. Long press that. It gives you the little Engway, and that's what the display looks like. Here, we'll get closer and look at the display. Right, so it looks like if you don't have any of the, pet, we got a horn here too, so these gonna have to cover your ears soon. So whenever we uh, have zero on the pedal assist, it looks like no throttle. Looks like right there the throttle kicks in, and it's looking like each assist level actually changes the speed of the full throttle too. So three, four five and that's it and then no load we're seeing 30.2 miles an hour under no load i said he got it to 33. there we go and then what's uh what's the power button like the speed button and there's some kind of speed button on here i don't think we should hit that <laughs> headlights headlight Horn, step back and cover your ear, Dee Dee. We don't want to hurt your ears. I'm thinking the horn is going to be like, meep. Let's see. More, oh. It was higher pitched, actually. <laughs> so that's pretty cool. Did I Scoot ever say which one was like the little power boost button? Um, I don't think so. 
Yeah, Bert, there we go. You got to long press it into sport mode. Long press the I and it goes into sport mode and let's see under no load what the full speed is. Oh yeah. 36 under 37. I saw it hit 37 for a second under lo no load. Wow. I kind of wish that boost would stay on. I wonder if there's a way to hack that out of there. Get in the controls and kind of program that out. So I'm going to turn that off. Actually, let me turn that back on. Let me just see if it has a um, a walking mode. Usually, up on the pedal assist gives you a walk. Nope. Down. Yep. So if you hold down, it gives you a walking mode. A lot of bikes do this. Looks like my battery's about 8%, so I'm going to have to turn this off, quit messing with it. I don't want to mess the batteries up, but I definitely got to get this sucker charging now. Um, and guys, we have more unboxings coming soon too. So I don't know if Dee did it like a poll or anything. Um, should we unbox the Segway scooter next or do you want the Rad Power bike with the little trailer and the center console? It's a Rad Power Rad Runner 3. So do you guys want to see a scooter? Transformer scooter. It's a limited edition Segway scooter that goes with my Bumblebee scooter. So I'm thinking I'll get another little plaque like this from there, which would be pretty cool. Limited edition numbered scooters and go karts. DD? They voted for the Segway Transformer scooter. All right, the scooter it is. Should we do it tomorrow night or Friday night? You guys want to see an unboxing tomorrow night or Friday night? Another unboxing tomorrow night, and we might have a kitty cat here. Let's go. <laughs> is the kitty cat going to be here? I wonder. I don't I hope know. So. We should ask for it to come. I think the kitty cats here will do even better on the stream. <laughs> that kitty cat, everybody loves a kitty cat. And I still didn't find where the key was for, for this battery. Anaconda like, said, let's see how D fits sitting on the e-bike. Go D, go. This is for, what's the height range for this? I don't think you can fit on this. I could fit, like looking at this, on the back seat, but that yeah, middle seat tall. is too tall for me. But it comes in a size 20 tire as well, so I could probably fit on that one. This is the 24 inch tire. I really do think that you're supposed to just like scoot this in there and scoot it forward. Bird Dog said I have a Megatron, Megatron wah ha A Megatron what? Amelia said nice, but I wish it was a dog instead of a cat. Aww, but we love the kitty cat. It's so nice. Bird and it Dog crawls said Angway is an excellent company. Uh, Anaconda, Angway uses the smallest 22A controllers and then the indicated speed is off by over 5%. Oh, you know I'm going to be using GPS for a show. Bird Dog said, can you limit it to 750 watt nominal? Nice boxers. Thank you. What are they? Tacos. I love tacos. <laughs> I think that's on there now. There we go. Remind well, me, guys, to tighten up the headlights in the rear. So, Brian McCann sent you a no message fenders. about the in motion RS scooter, 60 miles an hour. Damn, 60 miles an hour. That's awesome. I might tilt these handlebars a little bit farther back. It's a, a very far like reach forward the way I have it now. Long crank arms, though. This will be definitely a fun bike to pedal for sure. Damn, that's crazy. I can't believe they made a folding bike this big. That's insane. Any more questions, guys? So we're gonna be un unboxing the Segway Transformer scooter soon. Uh, if, you do, if you guys do wanna become a Shredhead member, right now there's a members only video that'll be released soon to the rest of the public. Um, it is the top three best Emotos that I tried out at Electrify Expo. Land Moto, I tried Rivet Anthem, Cake Caulk, and the Cake Osa also. I tried the Osa, I know it's not a Moto, but we tried that. Um, so, as always, if you guys want to support the channel, we do have all those links down below. Check out the link for the Angway electric bike at the X24. If Angway isn't for you, check out all those other links down below. There might be a bike you like. Any more questions before we end the stream? So, again, we're going to be going live very soon. No, actually, I can't end it. I, I got a, a special unboxing, guys. Hold on. Don't leave. Don't leave. People don't leave. How many people we got in here? 25. Do you guys want me to open? I'll, I'll show you this one. I'll open the, the, this one the next day. Um, so soon, this is for the Super 73 people. 
It's pretty much something that everybody's been looking for for such a long time. People are tired of having their e-bikes locked down uh, with a controller on the Super 73 right now. Uh, you can put it in mode four, have like unlimited throttle up to 32 miles an hour every time you turn off the bike, locks you back down to mode two. You gotta open up the app, do all this stuff. And um, on top of that, you can't push the full uh, 2000 or 2500 watts out of that motor. But look no further, because Handle Works came in for the save. Right now we got the BAC855. You can actually control this with a kilowatt app. Um, it does have its own stock tune, so you don't have to do anything. It's plug and play with the stock controller. You don't have to do any wiring, no soldering, nothing crazy at all. You get a display also with it. Do you have a discount link for that? Um, I'll be throwing a link out for these guys very soon. Friday, we, we might do the, the install very soon too. So it does come with the display, Super 73. I will be show, uh, throwing a link, a discount link out for this very soon. Again, the BAC comes with the BAC 55, um, some zip ties, and then your cable to hook your controller and your battery to it. Dude, this, this is gonna be awesome. I can't wait to see what the power of this thing feels like. And the fact that you can control your own bike, like if you know how to tune these things, you can get into the kilowatt app. Pretty much, you can break your bike. This will vo void your warranty 100%, but pretty much you can tune the bike to the way you want it. You want a really slow takeoff, snappier throttle. This is you, this is you guys. So Super 73, that, that install is gonna be coming very soon on my RX. So stoked I don't have to open up that app anymore. And I'll be pushing even more power out of that, that stock motor. So I can't wait for that. Um, any more questions now? That's you guys it. can send Shardy a message and he can send you the discount link. Yeah, if you guys are interested in that, just shoot me a message. I can shoot you a link uh, probably this Friday, a discount link for that. Bird so. Dogs said, what Megatron do you have? I don't believe you. <laughs> the, uh, it's a GT2 scooter. I'll unbox it very soon, Friday, I think. Tomorrow. And you did another Megatron video today. Oh, uh, no, that's the Bumblebee scooter. That's a Bumblebee go-kart. So we did the Bumblebee go-kart uh, review today. There's still some stuff we got to shoot, so the review isn't totally, totally done. But we'll be shooting uh, the rest of that soon. That review will be out. Top three best Emotos. My awesome time drifting at the Elec uh, Electrify Expo, trying out different bikes. Uh, what, what else? And anything else? Oh, our group ride that we just had this weekend with all the ticks all over us uh, riding. All of us had electric dirt bikes. There were Surons, there were Talarias, there were, uh, it was like a Denzel VMXO something. I forget the, the name of the bike. Uh, there were bomber bikes. Awesome time. Can't wait to actually edit down that video on my brand new laptop that I got. So happy. Um, any more questions? And I don't, I don't think there's a bell in here. And uh, as always, if you guys enjoyed that content, please consider subscribing, hitting that like button, and ringing that notification. Ding, ding, ding. The horn. <laughs> Where? Oh, yeah, let me turn on the bike. This is a late notification. Neighbors are like, shut up. And, ring, <laughs> and ringing that notification <laughs> to be notified when I'm making videos. And are you guys ready for the moment of silence for the subscribe button? In three, two, one, hit subscribe, heads down. All right, guys, I'll see you on the next live tomorrow or Friday. We're going to be unboxing the GT2 Transformer scooter from Segway. See you guys.